Welcome back to my tip this week. It is on how to put casings into your leaders. And the reason you would want casings is so that you have a place to put the rod for the red snappers, which is a way to load your quilts onto your leaders. Now, if you're going to do this, it's also a good time to square up your leaders and make sure you have straight edges. I have an article that will teach you how to do that. So you can take that article in addition to what I teach right now and combine the two and you'll have square leaders that also have casings in them for the red snappers. Um, so right now I have this leader. Oh, a lot of people ask, do I need to buy new leaders? No, you don't. Um, but if they're in bad shape, maybe it's worth it. This is a little bit tricky because you have to manage your leader and your machine at the same time, but it is doable. So I'm going to show you how it's doable. Now I have a really big hem on this um, leader here. And so I'm going to tighten it up to three quarters of an inch. Three quarters of an inch is the right size for this to fit into there nicely. It'll fit snugly but not too tight. Um, when you make your hem, I suggest you don't iron or steam the edge. Um, a lot of these canvases have not been pre-shrunk and so you'll have some shrinkage happen, and so your square leader won't be square anymore. So here we go. I'm going to just, I, I drew my line with a ruler like this. I measured three quarters of an inch, and I have that the whole length, and I'm going to use my long arm to do the stitching. Now, it's a little bit tricky, and I'm going to want to go slowly and carefully and not um, stitch on my fingers. Now, notice I'm using red thread. I'm doing that for a reason. I want this line to be contrasting and the reason is I will line up the edge of my quilt back or top whatever goes there I will line it up um, on that line so the nicer and straighter I can do this the better and I might only just do a few inches at a time I'm going to stop with in my needle down position so that it'll hold that now it helps if you have your clamps and you bring them so that they hold this taut once you get off the very edge there. And it will help you to manage the, the weight and the size of your canvas. So I'm going to try to do the best I can to stay right on that line. And I'm just going to inch along until I get to the end. And now I have a casing in the edge of my leader.